Read right now. Who made my lunch? From Peanuts to Peanut Butter by Bridget Hios, illustrated by Stephanie Pfizer Coleman, published by Amicus. For a delicious peanut butter sandwich, just twist, spread, and eat. But what if you had to make the peanut butter yourself, and you also had to grow the peanuts? As a peanut farmer, you'll need to live in a warm climate. Peanuts need about five warm months to grow, so they are grown in the sunny southern United States. For seeds, you'll use peanut kernels. No snacking. You need these to grow more peanuts. Use a tractor to plant the seeds in long rows. Water and wait. Where are the peanuts? Peanuts grow underground, but they are not roots. Flowers grow on the peanut plant. Inside each flower is a pod. The pod droops to the ground. Then it pushes underground. There, it becomes a peanut. He'll never find us here. Five months later, you can harvest the peanuts. Drive a tractor with a digger attachment up and down the rows. The digger pulls up the peanut plants and shakes off the soil. It lays the plants upside down on the ground. Let the peanuts dry for a couple days. Then drive a combine, a machine that does a combination of jobs. First, it picks up the plants. Next, it separates the peanuts from the plants. The peanuts will dry for a while longer in a large peanut wagon. With a fan blowing warm air, now the peanuts are trucked to the shelling plant. Let's crack open those nuts. At the shelling factory, a machine called a sheller pushes the peanuts through grates, removing the shells. This happens several times until only kernels remain. Put the kernels in big bags. And send them to the peanut butter factory. At the peanut butter factory, you'll roast the peanuts in a hot oven. The tray moves up and down so that the peanuts shake while they bake. This way, they cook evenly. The white peanuts turn light brown, the color of peanut butter. Mmm, smells so good. The roasted peanuts move between rubber belts, which removes the skins. Save those. Farmers feed them to their pigs. Next, a machine splits the kernels and removes the heart. That's the tiny lump inside the peanuts. The hearts are a little bitter, but birds love them. Time to make peanut butter, smooth or crunchy. For crunchy, put most of the nuts in the grinder, which grinds them into a smooth paste. Put the rest in the chopper, which chops them into small pieces. Mix the ground peanuts, chopped peanuts, a little vegetable oil, and salt for flavor. No need to add butter; that's only in the name. Not in the actual peanut butter. For smooth peanut butter, all of the nuts go into the grinder, and no pieces are added. Both types are now put in jars. Then another machine seals the jars, screws on lids, and pastes on labels. The peanut butter is off to the grocery store. And on to your sandwich. Thanks to the peanut farmers 
shellers, and factory workers, you have a delicious sandwich to eat. If you loved this book, order a copy of your own by clicking the link in the description below. To stay up to date with our read alouds, be sure to subscribe. See you next time on Read Right Now.